guys, it's KJ48, and welcome back to my 7 Days to Die single player Let's Play. This is going to be a brand new Let's Play for Alpha 12, Season 12, Episode 1. Oh boy, here we are. Um, man, huge update, huge update. I can't even go over all of the things in the update notes. What I want you guys to do is I want you to go to the 7 Days to Die website and check out the update notes. Some of the things that I'm really looking forward to for this update are... The mini bike, of course, they've added a mini bike, which you have to find parts for and put together. Uh, they've also changed the look of the sky. They've they've messed around with the loot. Uh, there's supposed to be uh, weather cycles in the game, uh, rain, snow, all kinds of stuff. Uh, on a side note, they reset all my options as far as the uh, the sound of the game goes. So the sound of the game might be a little weird in the beginning, and just bear with me, and we'll get that sorted out as the Let's Play goes on. Uh, just made my first stone axe. Um, what do we got here? Qualities 50, tools, traps, basic, durability, entity damage. That all looks the same, except they redid the font a little bit. And you can right-click on stuff and drop, take. You should also be able to uh, shift-click in and out of inventories, even uh, crates. Another thing they did for this update is they merged the biomes. Uh... There's, oh, look at that, that melee option is different. Melee, look at that, that's a different melee uh, swing. They actually merged the biomes, so there's, the biomes will interlock, uh, meet each other more organically, and there's not gonna be just rivers around the biomes. So that's pretty cool. Uh, this is a huge update, and we're, you guys are just gonna have to watch the Let's Play, and we will go over the update as we see things coming. Um, there we go, look at the tree falling. Trees now fall, and there's my wood. Really? Two pieces of wood. Is that normal? Ooh. I is no longer inventory. Has that... I never been inventory? I used to be inventory. I'm almost positive. Now tab is inventory. A lot of these games... By the way, I got six logs from that. So let's go ahead and craft that. Let's go ahead and make some... Oh, you can't just right-click to split in half anymore. Um, you could see what you could craft from each item. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, it's, yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad. How do I split them in half, though? Uh, craft, take, drop, examine. I can't split these in half? How do I... Oh, boy. How do I split these in half? Scrap. Can't scrap it. Take. Huh. Well... I don't know how to uh, I don't know how to take like half of these uh, planks or five planks or six planks. I don't know how to <clears throat> how to put stuff. You know, that's weird. I'm gonna have to mess around with that. Um, let's go ahead and make this some sticks. Uh, I don't know how many. Uh, how about? Can you just type it in? Yes. Okay, because you can type it in. That's pretty cool. I like that. Here we go, and we leveled up. Because we crafted ourselves some sticks. Here's our guy. This pretty much looks all the same. Alright, so now we got some sticks. Let's go ahead and get some grass. And we're going to make ourselves a bow. Uh, how much... I keep hitting I for the inventory. That's going to take some getting used to. Um, oh, I made all of them in the sticks. I must have did something wrong. I didn't want to make them all in the sticks. Alright, whatever. Um, miscellaneous. Tools and traps. No, it's a weapon. Weapon, wooden bow, just one craft. Okay. The wooden bow is now a piece of crap wooden bow. Really? Zero entity Oh, that's right. The entity damage is on the uh is on the arrows. We need to make some arrows. I don't know if I I wanna I gotta figure out how to uh, actually take a certain amount of items um, out of a stack. Like say if I have like ninety six wood. What is that? That's a bug. Oh, house is cool. Oh, zombies. Not good, not good. Let's get some stones. Yeah, look at the... You see the white, like, lines up there? That's a bit of a bug. Uh, Mad Mole actually said that there would be problems with this alpha. There's going to be bugs. And uh, they wanted to get it out before July 4th. And the, you know, they're going to fix them over the next few days. So, not a big deal. This game isn't alpha, so... We have to expect things like that to happen. All right, now we're getting some stones here. All 
I'm not sure if I, I think I hear zombies. Oh god, the inventory thing is gonna be a problem. Arrow. Oh, that's right, I didn't get any feathers, what am I thinking? Alright, oh boy, zombie, zombies everywhere. So in order to get feathers, you have to find birds' nests, so that's what I'm going to be looking for. This is going to be tough, this is going to be tough. My uh, my settings are pretty much down the middle, um, as far as settings go. Uh, you know, I don't have like, like things like craft timers or loot timers, I don't like those, but I do turn up the zombies to max. Um, and I did put it on a warrior difficulty. But this is not going to be easy. I, I haven't seen any bird's nests. Either they took them out or they're the same color as the ground that I'm kind of missing them. Is there any kind of clubs we can make? Uh, weapons. I mean, we can make a wooden club. I mean, honestly, a wooden club's kind of crappy. Can't make that. Uh, nah, none of this stuff's that good. We need bird's nests. Look at the ground, it's it's like, um, I like the ground, it looks cool, it looks like there's, like, leaves, you know, like, dead leaves all over the ground. Um. Oh, there we go, bird's nest. Very good, very good. Ugh, I keep pressing I. Arrow. Craft all the arrows. More arrows. So you can make different kind of arrows now. Um, these have no entity damage. Like these say, they don't do any damage, but I'm I'm assuming that's a that's that's not true. Oh, there's a split option. Do I have that on everything? I don't have the split option on everything. That's kind of annoying. Oh, there's a split option on the sticks. Okay. All right. Let's see if we can do some damage. Uh, let's take a look at the map. We should head back over to the road. See if we can find a house to stay in. I'm just looking for a house to stay for the night. Uh, for those of you who don't know about this game, at you know a certain time when the when the sun goes down and it gets dark, uh, the zombies will start sprinting, and then they are going to destroy you if you're not inside or prepared for them. Um, yeah, those little white things are kind of a problem. It looks like they're for the trees. Let's take a look at my options really quick. Uh, video, texture, tree quality is middle. Let's put that on ultra. Okay, my game crashed. Um, yeah, but tree quality is now ultra, so even though my game crashed, at least it got done. Alright, so let's right click on the cotton, and actually we don't need to right click on it. Let's just do this. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I just wasted all my cotton. Basically what happened was, I put my cotton up here and I right click on it to split it in half, then I put another one on top of it, and then that makes the cloth, but I accidentally scrapped it. Ugh. God, that sucks. Um, it's taking me a little bit to get used to this stuff. I don't- I want to be able to right click to split stuff. I hope they put that back. Uh, for those of you who are new to this game, um, you could right click on an item and it would split the stack in half. And it, I really liked it. I thought it was great and I'm used to it. But they decided to change it. Um, some stacks I can split, some I can't. Uh, I'm pretty sure they're going to fix all this later on because it doesn't make any sense. Alright, cotton, there. I can't split this cotton. Yeah, that, that's a problem. I, there's no way for me to split this cotton that I'm aware of. I will look it up in between videos. I'm actually going on vacation soon. I have to record six videos tonight. So that's why I don't really have a lot of time to look this stuff up. Alright, well, let's just do this. Let's right click. Craft. Resources. Cloth fragments. Max. I'm not sure what max is. Five. Okay. Okay. I don't, I don't think I like that that way of crafting. I like it the way it was before. Fragment. Craft. Craft. Uh, miscellaneous? Resources? No. Building? Sleeping bag. Craft. 
Now we have a place to respawn. Uh, if we get in trouble, we'll just place down that sleeping bag. And then uh, if we die, we'll respawn at the sleeping bag. It's basically our spawn point. Alright. Let's uh, chop down another tree. They made the uh, stone axe a lot better. Like back, you know, before you used a stone axe. Man, you'd have to use an entire stone axe just to cut down one tree. I'm glad they, they fixed that. There you go. Falling down. By the way, if that falls on a zombie, they do get killed. So that's pretty cool. It's just going to take some time to get used to this, uh, the game mechanics. They're, they're brand new. I mean, these game mechanics are very different from what I was using, from what I was doing before. Okay, alright, here we go. Our first customer of the day. Ooh. Hit her. Really? Whoa, three hits to the head and she's knocked down, huh? Four hits to the head? No, something's wrong. Oh, that's right, the bow is crap now. I forgot. Well, I can't kill anything then. <laughs> Maybe I should try and melee with this thing. Maybe it's better than it used to be. I don't know. I don't know how I'm supposed to kill stuff. Yeah, the bow used to come out, like, yellow. So it's pretty much the best bow you could possibly get. And it went from the best bow you could possibly get to utterly useless. If you shoot a zombie in the head five times and they don't die, that, that item is useless in my book. Alright. Let's try and melee. Okay, you... Four, five, five, all right, five hits. Ooh, did you see that arrow hit tip? A bear. Oh, God. I was told the bears are no joke, and I believe it. Okay. I might have to turn down my zombie spawns a little bit. I might not be able to handle this with the bow being such a piece of crap. You know what? That's too many zombies. It's not even worth killing them. Oh, look at this building. Oh, it's so cool looking. I want to live in one of these buildings. Um, but the problem is I can't really fight anything. Like, I can't kill stuff. Oh, it's raining! Ooh, a tent. Tents. Let's see what's over there. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't... I don't know. Might be in a little bit of trouble here. Look at this rock. Careful. Careful. I, I might turn down the zombie spawns one notch because this is this might be too much for me. Okay. I keep pressing in I to open my inventory. Got a much better melee weapon at least. I don't like the way the zombies keep spawning where you're gonna be where you're gonna be. Like, if I leave an area... Am I bleeding? Is that the new bleeding icon? Healing. Wait, I'm healing? That doesn't sound right. Wait, hold on. I'm confused. 
healing modifiers healing one health every 60 seconds you have enough food to slowly heal oh okay that's pretty cool i like that yeah if there's a lot of zombies in an area and i go running off i don't think more zombies should be spawning where i go like then you never really get away i think you should be able to get away but with that being said i do have the zombie spawns on high and that bow is useless by the way might as well just melee. Uh, I keep pressing I to bring up the inventory. Why'd they change that? I mean, I guess I could always change it back, but... Let's put that right there, that there. You're good there. Let's take those pills. Well, we'll hold on to the pills for now. Ooh, a deer. I like these roads, man. These roads are awesome. They look good. They really do. These roads look fantastic. We are going to have to find a place to stay eventually. Okay. More of those arrow tips. Let me take a look at those. Craft. Iron arrows. Now how do I put them in the bow? I don't know. R? Hmm. How do I put the iron one iron ones in the bow? I'm gonna have to look that up. Alright, let's see how good this thing is. One shot. Two shots. And as we're fighting this one zombie, we're gaining many, many more. See why it's not worth it? Right, let's get out of here. Alright. Alright. Alright, let's kill some more. We don't have much longer till nighttime, though. I don't know where I'm supposed to stay. Glue? What the hell is glue for? Huh. I might have to dig underground. I didn't think I'd have to do that this season, but... I think I'm gonna have to. Uh, craft. Uh, tools. Stone shovel. Yeah, I think I'm just going to go dig underground, I guess. Let's just go this way. There's these little dirt roads here. Oh, I thought there was a dirt, dirt road here, but maybe not. But they're supposed to take you to points of interest. I think I'm, I think I'm just going to come out here. When I don't see some zombies, I'm going to dig underground. Coal. Alright. This might be a decent enough spot, I guess. This is desperate times, man. Desperate times that I gotta do this. Alright, we're gonna take a little break here. Get some energy back. Uh, let's place down the sleeping bag. Mm, guess we have to make some room for it. No? There we go. Alright, we're gonna try and be quiet here and get underground. Oh god. It takes so long to dig dirt. Really? Well, I am out of stamina. Alright, well, you know what? Let's go ahead and take our wood. And let's go ahead and craft up some building wood frames. How many? How many wood frames? Ten. 
Very good, very good. Put those on our hot bar. Continue digging. This is desperate times, man, where I'm digging a hole again. <laughs> oh god, am I laughing or crying? Now that's too high. Let's put it right there. There. I hope not. Now we could definitely put a thing up there. There we go. And I'm gonna have to apologize right away for the darkness, but um, it, it can't be helped at the moment. By the way, for those of you who are new to this game, that little uh, crosshair thingy on my screen, that means I'm, that means I am undetected. And while we're waiting for our, our stamina to come back, let's go ahead and craft this up a secure wooden chest. Yeah, that bow is useless. I'm not even going to use it. Like, seriously. Five uh, five arrow shots to kill a zombie? No, that's just not going to... Not going to do it. Ooh, how far down does the dirt go? I think I am on a hill, though. I usually just dig down to stone. Yeah, my stamina is really going quick. I'm not sure if I want to even keep these, these parts. I mean, they're, like, faulty. Like, what am I going to do with those? Let's see if we can craft this up some pants. Browse. I don't know what that is. How about, let's see what we can make here as far as clothes go. Cloth. Oh, we need cloth for that, that's right. Okay. That's a bear up there fighting zombies, by the way. Ooh, this is cool. This, uh, this dirt goes down deep. You know what? I may not have enough ladders to get out of here. Oh, no, I will. I will. Uh, okay, well, let's make another one. Nope, I don't have enough stone to make another shovel. Crap. All right, well, let's go ahead and craft this up some... What do we want to make here? Uh, ladders, so that's got to be building, right? Eight should be good. 24. Oh, you get... Oh, that's why, um, because you get, like, I guess eight times four, you get four per craft. Let's take a look at that again. If you're going to craft a ladder. No, it doesn't say you get four. It doesn't say you get four. So if I craft one ladder, it should give me one, not three. That's not sure if that's a bug or not. Yeah, you get three per. Um, if you're going to get three per of something, it should tell you. Just saying. Okay, that's fine. Well, this is going to be pretty boring. So I'm going to call this one here. Um, I can't even leave here because the zombies are going to be running soon. And there is a bear up there and I don't want to deal with them. Um, so I'm going to call this one here. Actually, I don't think I... No, I can get out of here. I just don't want to go up there with the bear. I'm scared. I'm a scared. All right, guys, we're going to call this one here. That is going to be it for... Actually, that is not going to be it for episode one. I forgot. We have to do a giveaway for episode one. All right, here's the deal, guys. I am going on vacation tomorrow. I will not be back till July 9th. And I'm thinking July 10th or July... Uh, July 10th or July 11th, which is a Friday or Saturday, I'm going to do the giveaway. Um, the, the secret word for the giveaway is jump. And what I need you guys to do is use the word jump, um, in a sentence in the comments, try and make it a natural sentence. Don't just say jump because that's lazy. Uh, think of something funny to say. I don't know. And, uh, what I'll do is I'll use a random number generator to pick out uh, of a hat, all the people that said jump and you will get a free copy of seven days to die. Um, again, the giveaway will be finished and I will do the random number generator probably on the 10th or the 11th, which is July 10th or July 11th. I believe that's a Friday or Saturday. Use the word jump at, in the bottom to be entered for the giveaway. And that's going to be it for episode one. And I'll see you next time for episode two. Till then, take it easy.